I was doing a Google Maps and uh, for uh, stay route 27 if I was going to Kentucky I, I like to bike it to southeast Kentucky uh, mom and dad my, my sister and a lot of my relatives live down there and they live in Weensburg it's McCreary County Kentucky southeast anyway you know I can bike it f uh, five miles in 19 minutes and it's uh, I'll show you the map in a second uh, it's actually it, it it's not as long as I, it's three hours i've always said about three hours 45 it, my car 75 i'd be going to stay around 27 on, stay around 27 on the bike by car it's three hours and 26 minutes now I should, now now 27 i knew followed 75 it's probably 10 or 15 extra miles because as uh, 27 you know goes east and west a little bit so it adds a few more miles but what surprised me, I didn't realize 27, see the bike trail in Loveland now goes all the way to downtown Cincinnati. And I was looking on the maps and State Route 27, I always thought State Route 27 was farther south into northern Kentucky. But 27 uh, near, is nearly, it's real close. I'll show you the map. It's re, it connects real close to Cincinnati. So I can get on the bike trail down here in Loveland and I'm on 27 so basically it's a straight shot for me all the way to strunk kentucky i could probably bike it in about 12 14 hours yeah i didn't realize 27 went that far north yeah it goes right near it's gotta look real close but it goes right near cincinnati and now the level one bike trail goes all the way to downtown cincinnati you go to level and go to the bike trail you look you'll see a sign it says since downtown cincinnati 27 miles so I can bike it with no problem all the way to downtown Cincinnati. I just get on 27 straight shot to my mom and dad's in South on the Kentucky Tennessee state line. See, according to uh, 27 here, if you look real close, see how see how close it see how close it gets to Cincinnati. Well, the bike trail in Loveland right here now go the bike trail now goes all the way to downtown cincinnati all i gotta do is probably have to travel two or three miles i get on 27 see 27 and you'll notice how it follows 75 even though it's a little east and west of it now I get down here's a little west of it it adds probably 12 to 15 miles to my trip which ain't no problem but you know i can bike it in five miles in 19 minutes now once you get down here you start to get it into the mountains it might slow me down a little bit but i've got enough momentum and speed you know I, mountains ain't hurting me too well, i've been biking since 1988 mountains ain't really a problem i don't like climbing but anyway down here see 27 now <laughs> Right down there. Now, now my mom and dad, and all my uncles, would be uh, west of me, and that would be the easy part down there. But uh, oh, I could have asked someone about. You know how you? It's it's like asking for directions. It's always the best to do it. You know, look yourself, right? But I didn't realize 27 went that far north. Yeah, if I bike it, it'll I'll be following 75 all the way. But I'll be on State Route 27 all the way to Kentucky Tennessee state line. Yeah, that's a Kentucky Tennessee state line. Might bike it 10, 12 hours estimated, maybe quicker.